In this video I show you another example of our LR0 automaton, how it processes an input string. In this case the input string is ABB. And well, most of the thing, the steps I already explained in the previous video. So I'm in Q0, this is my remaining input. In Q0 the only thing I can do is I can shift my A, so I will get the new in the new line with the new stack entry Q0 with the A that was shifted and the table tells me that I'm going into Q1 afterwards. Then now I'm in Q1, the only thing I can do, oh, the remaining input, now the remaining input is BB and dollar because I shifted the S and the action was a shift into Q1. Now the in Q1 the only thing I can do is is a reduce with rule R2 so with this rule that means I'm replacing this part by I keep the Q0 I replace it by the non-terminal A and then from Q0 with the non-terminal A I'm going into state 2 I have the same remaining input and I did a reduce with, with rule number 2. Then in Q2 what I can do is I can either shift an A or shift a B. In my remaining input I have a B so I'm going to shift that B. That means now I add a B to here and now I'm going into Q3. Now my, my remaining input has only one B left and the action was a shift into 3. And now in Q3 what I can do is a reduce with rule number 4. So that is this one, that's what I'm doing now. That means I'm replacing the whatever is at the right hand side of this rule, I will replace it. I'm keeping Q0, A, Q2 and now I add the B I got from reducing with the rule and from Q2 with the B I'm going to state 4. This is left. I did a reduce with rule number 3. Then in Q4, the only thing I can do is a reduce with rule number one, that is this one. Now I have now I have to replace all this part because it's the right hand side of the rule. I replace it by S. And Q0 with an S, I'm going to Q6. I have my remaining input left and I did a reduce with rule number one. Now the only thing I can do in state number 6 is I can accept the input string but I can only do that if I have no remaining input left but I have a remaining input. I'm in my final state, I can't do anything more but I have um, input strings left to read so that means the parsing process was not successful because we tried to pass an input string that is not part of the language this automaton accepts.